Hi friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Kristen, this is Intentional Living, and today we are stuffing my cash envelopes and sinking funds for the third week of July with my full-time paycheck. Today is July 14th and we should be stuffing $695, so I'm gonna grab that real quick. Also, I'm not sure if you can tell, but I have new lighting. I installed a um, softbox light above me, so I'm hoping that that helps with the lighting and the shadowing. So today is the trial run and we will see how it goes. But $6.95 should be what this is and we will give it a count right now. So we have 100, 150, 200, 250. 270, 290, 310, 330, 350, 370, 390, 410, 430, 450, 460, 470, 480, 490, 500, 510, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 490, 495, I think it was 595, 600. I could be wrong, but I think it's 600, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85. So 685, and this should be 10 ones. Um, 86, 7, 8, 9, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 695. So that is correct. Okay. And we are going to start with my wallet today and unstuff whatever we have left. So eating out, we have $1 left and we are going to be putting in $40 as usual today. So we will do two 20s, so 20, 40. My wallet has been pretty boring lately because I've been budgeting pretty well, so Sorry if it's boring. Um, it's always the same amount. Coffee, we have five, six, and seven dollars left, and that gets 15 every week. 10 and a five. And then weekend fun. This is all just gonna have what it has. Weekend fun gets 25, and we have six dollars left. But we will add 25 in here and that will do it for my wallet for this week. So let's see what all we are adding. So rollover we have 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 dollars and those are going into my five and one dollar savings challenges. Here is my one dollar challenge and we are adding four ones today. is truly a brick of ones <laughs> in here. So there is that, all stopped. And then that $5 challenge is right here. And we have five, no, we're not counting it, Kristen, stop it. Okay, have it but that is the $5 challenge. <laughs> oh, sorry. Okay, um, let's do our cash envelopes next because that binder is right here. And then we will go and do my um, shared expenses and bills. Close is receiving $10 today. So now in close, we have 10, 15, and $20 in there. So that's good. Date night, we have 120. We are not adding anything today. Fitness and wellness is receiving $10. So we have 10, 20, 30 in there. I'm going to need some more pre-workout pre soon. So that is why I'm stuffing this back up again gas. So when I was out of town on my girl's trip, Colin, my boyfriend, took my car 
on an errand and um, he filled me, my whole tank up with gas. I didn't have very much gas left and he filled the entire tank. And y'all know with gas prices right now, that is love. So we're only adding $5 today to gas. So now we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, and 100 dollars in gas. So I have three quarters of a tank now. And I really appreciate him for that. So now I get to stuff money other places. Giving is receiving five. Oh wait, that had ones. So we have 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, and 50 dollars in giving, which is I think the most I've ever had in giving. Um, I am giving it more money these days. I'm giving it five dollars instead of one dollar, but still it's stacking up really nicely. Going out, so there's actually more money in going out than there was in my last video, and that is because I had to sell a concert ticket because of a conflict with a wedding that I'm gonna be going to. So I put the $60 from that back in here. So now we have 100, 150, 200, 210, and 220. But we won't have 220 for long because um, the same artist is going to a different city and I'll just buy a ticket for that city soon. Hosting is going to get $5 because um, my boyfriend and I have a housewarming party in uh, almost a week's time. So I have 100, 10, 15, 20, 125 in hosting. And then medical is receiving $10. So we have 10, 15, 16, 17, and 18 right now in medical, and I'm not going to take those ones out right now just because, actually, no, I'm not going to because I want to keep as much in here as possible. Self-care, however, has lots of ones. We've got one, two, three, four, and these I will take out and put in my $1 savings, and we are going to add $2 or $20 today. Um, I paid for my haircut, I believe, and that is why I have change. So those $4 we will put in my $1 savings at the end of this binder. Spending is not receiving anything and it has $5. And then toiletries I spent um, because I got new toothbrush heads, so this dollar will go to the $1 savings and we are putting $5 in here today. So we will rebuild toiletries. And that is going to do it for my cash envelopes. I'm going to go ahead and add, oh no, I just broke my zipper. Okay, I'm gonna have to work on this off camera to fix it because I definitely busted this zipper. Um, but we are going to add these five $1 into my $1 savings and I'm going to try and fix this after this video. So now we will move on to our shared expenses, which are the ones I split with my boyfriend. This is just my half of the contribution. Um, groceries get $75 each week. So we have 50, 75. So now in groceries, we have 50, 100, 150, 170, 175, 180, and 181. I'll pull that one out. I guess I was wrong. So we have 180 in groceries. I really like having this buffer for groceries where I'm not going empty every month or every week because my grocery trips really fluctuate. Like certain weeks I spend a lot and other weeks I don't spend anything. Household is receiving $35, so a 20, a 10, and a five. We upped this this week because we went to Ace Hardware and spent a lot of money on um, painting supplies because we're going to paint our, I'm going to paint our bathroom today and tomorrow. So we have 20, 35, 36, 37, 38, and 39, and I am going to leave those ones. I'm actually going to add this one to make it 40, um, just because we need as much money as we can in here because we are also about to buy a few more things for the housewarming party. So, um but like there are things for the house. So like we need to get a carpet in a one room. We need to get an outdoor mat in another. So things for the house, but we wanna get them before the house warming. So I'll pull it from here. Yard work is getting $5. So now we have 10, go away, there we go. Okay, so $10 in yard work. 
Home Maintenance is receiving $5 and we have 10 also in here. Furniture is receiving $5 today and you'll see that we have less money in here. So we have $300 now and that is because we, um, I, what did I spend money on? I spent money on something and I decided to pull it from furniture because it would have fallen under my moving budget, but I used a lot of furniture, like what I could have pulled from furniture I used out of my moving budget. So this time I pulled it from furniture because my moving budget is empty. So anyway, it's at $300 now. So when we add the five, we will be at 305 and the $300 is in the bank. And we are about to buy a new dining room table. So that might get pulled from here whenever that happens. And then savings today, I bumped back down just for the week because of household. So it's getting five. So you have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 85, and 90 in savings. And that is it for our shared expenses. And now we can jump into bills. Rent gets $150 today and I do owe rent tomorrow. So we'll do 150. So now in rent, we have 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 650, 700, 750, 800, 820, 45. So 845, which is more than I need for rent tomorrow. Rent is just 750 for me. So that's great. So good to go for rent. Electricity is, or not electricity, utilities is receiving $30. So we'll do a 20 and a 10 in here. So now we have 50, 70, 90, 100, 110, 11, 12, 13, and 14. So 114 in utilities. And we are gonna keep those ones in there. Phone bill gets $15. So a 10 and a five, and this five is literally taped together. It's so sad. Um, so now we have 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, and $45 in phone bill. Jim is getting $20. So we have 50, 70, 90, 110, and 120 in gym, which is plenty. So I can probably back off this next week. My Roth IRA contribution, um, my, so I forget if I, I feel like I told y'all that um, I auto paid more <laughs> than I like should have, or I paid extra on top of my auto pay in the past. So now when my auto pay comes, I'm going to pull it out of my envelope so that I know it's been paid. So um, anyway, so my automatic payment came out. So now it's empty. So now we're adding $55 back into it. So I am going to start pulling it just as it hits like I do all my other bills. So I don't confuse myself and end up paying more than I budgeted. So I'm still trying to even all that out from that mistake. But really just saving more for retirement is a good thing. So Apple has 20, 45, 55, 56, 57, and 58, which is plenty. And then my insurances for car and renters is getting $15 this week. So a 10 and a five. So we have 50, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 115, 120, 125, and 130. And I'm gonna pull out two fives because we're gonna need more fives and put in a 10. So we should still have 130. And then nonprofit support or monthly giving is receiving $5. So we have five, Five. I haven't even added the $5. 20, 30, 5, 36, 37, 38, and $39 in here. And that 
is going to do it for this week in bills, which is getting pretty stacked. So I'm excited for a condensing at the end of the month. So now we get to move on to our sinking funds, which is always my favorite part. We have our fun sparkle binder here today, and we are going to start as always with birthdays. We have saved $200 for my boyfriend's birthday and we are working on my friend Bree's birthday and she is receiving $5 today. So now Bree has five, 10, 15, 20, and 25. So we have $225 in total for our birthdays. Electronics today is going to receive $5. So we have 500, 600 in the bank, 650, 670, 675, 680. So getting close to another $100 slip in here. Hopefully we can reach that this month. Family is also receiving $5 because I am traveling home this month. So we have 20, 25, 30, 35, and 40. And I am going to put two fives back for a 10 in here. We still have 40. I think that should be all the change we need. Future is receiving 20 because that is what we scratched off last full time paycheck stuffing. So we have 1,000 in the bank and then 20, 40, 60, 75. So 1,000. 75. Yes. And we get to now scratch for next time. We are almost done with this challenge. So let's do this one. Another 20. That'll do. So another $20 next time. Holidays is getting $5. We are working on Indigenous Peoples Day. So we will add a five in here. So we have five, 10, 15, 20, and 25 now in here. And the goal is 30. So next time we will be done. And then planner is not getting anything and it has 50. Neither is subscriptions, which also has 50, and neither is volleyball, which has 100. I am going to go back to volleyball in September, so that is exciting. I will start stopping this again at that point. And then Weddings and Babies is receiving $15 today, so we'll do a 10 and a 5. So we have 1,000, 100, 200, 300, 400. 1410 20 25 30 35 40 45 so 1445 dollars in weddings and babies once we get to 50 dollars i'm going to start shopping for my sister-in-law's baby shower gift so that'll be fun and that is it for this binder next up we have our box challenge and we can go up to 20 dollars today in here can't do 40 we could do 15 if I can get a five to go with it, but let's just do 20. I'm gonna, I keep pulling really nice 20s and I just don't wanna fold them and put them in here. Let's do that one. Okay. So $20 in here. And we'll put these back. Hopefully I can get back to budgeting $40 a week soon. Okay, now on to Big Blue. We are going to start with car maintenance. We will add $15 to car maintenance into our emergency fund. And now an emergency fund, we have 1,000, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55. So 1,000, $155 in emergency fund. And then we have our 250 in deductible and our 100 in oil changes. So we met our $1,500 mark and we have $1,505. So we are just gonna keep going and forever add to car maintenance because you never know. Christmas, we are putting in $10 today. 
So we have 20, 30, 40, 50, 60 dollars in other people for gifts. So we have 60 in there and then we have 100, 200, 300, 400, 500. So we have 560 saved in Christmas. Europe, we are adding $10 towards flights. Slow and steady on this one. So we have 500, 600, 700 in the bank for flights, and then 710, 20, and 30. And then we do have another $100 for any pre trip expenses. So that is 830 for Europe. And then seasonal activities is receiving $5, and we are working on fall. Let's do ones. I forgot I even had ones. One, two, three, four, five. So now in fall, we have 20, 40, 45, 50, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, and 60 in fall. So getting close to 100. And then I think summer we had 170. Yes. So we have $230 in total for seasonal activities. And that is great. And then last but not least, we have vacation, which I did just put in here right now. We will be making new envelopes this weekend. So now in vacation, we're adding 10, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. So now we have 1,000 in the bank. 20, 40, 55, 65, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, and 75 dollars. So we have 1,075, which is amazing for just future vacations that I don't know about yet. That is going to do it for today. I hope y'all enjoyed the stuffing. Thank y'all for being here, and I will catch you in my next video. Bye.